What'd you say? Good afternoon, clean team. Miles. Kevin. And Carlo. wait, there you go. Same. Carlo. We are here with Advanced Cleaning Systems, and in today's video, we're going to be washing a huge airy rug. It's not as big as the last airy rug that we washed. Well, that you guys have seen us wash. But this rug right here is a 12 by 15. Now, it doesn't look too bad on this side, but right here in this corner, you can see it gets pretty yellow. Now, I want to show you guys something really cool. Go to dad's cart right here. All right, so this right here is the hydro sensor. You see me use this at the end of the video to make sure that the rug is dry. Now, these areas, the rug is dry, but right here where it's pretty yellow and the urine is, watch this. It's pretty cool. So. Basically, urine, it dries up to a gummy substance. It never dries completely. Got some more right here in this corner. This is what you guys saw us doing earlier, taking out the tile. But yeah, we're just remodeling just a tad bit. We've been working hard all day and we're gonna finish it off in a satisfying way. We're gonna be washing this wool airy rug. So if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe, hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on my future uploads. Smash that like button and we'll go ahead and get today's video started. So we actually flipped the rug over with the back side facing up and we have it on our grates right now. We usually use our rug duster, but with this rug, it is super thin. And if we use our rug duster, it's just gonna be moving it around. So we're gonna be using our Sanitair with the beater bar on the bottom to run over the back and vacuum it. It's gonna dislodge the soil so it can fall into the floor. We're gonna sweep it up for you guys, show you how much we got out of this rug. And um, of course, once we vacuum the top of it, we're gonna be showing you what came out of the Royal Vacuum. But looking on the back side, you can definitely see the urine a little bit more. is done using the sanitary now we're gonna flip it over on the front side and use the royal and see how much we got in that bag after how much soil do you think we're gonna have in that royal bag you think it's gonna be full half a bag what you think not much not much what about you Carlo think it's gonna be think it's gonna be a lot all right my prediction is half a bag oh you hear the difference when it gets right there oh, wow It's harder to push right there in that area. So right there on the corner where all the urine is, you can definitely hear the difference in the vacuum. The brush is turning on it. Cayman said it's a lot harder to push also. get this one pre-treated now what we decided to do was pre-treat this rug and then we're going to roll it up and put it into the trough and let it dwell for about an hour and while we do that we're going to be sweeping this up and do some other stuff around the shop so the pre-treatment can dwell and it can break that urine up here we can get this rug all the way clean All right, so now dad is adding our acidic urine pretreatment. And what we did was put the two corners with the most urine at the bottom. So this and that side right there have 
the most urine that you guys saw. So we're going to put a little extra in the corners. All right, so we rolled up the grates and we're sweeping up all the dry soil. Doesn't look like it's that much on the ground, but we're gonna see how much it is when he pushes it all up to the top and we get it in the dustpan. Now it's time to open up the Royal. More than I thought. Yeah, I don't even remember how much I said. I think I said half a bag. I was wrong. What'd you think about that, Carlo? <laughs> <laughs> that is a lot. This rug has been in the trough for about 45 minutes in the pre-treatment. And you can just see the urine coming out. Liquid gold, baby. We just pulled this rug out of the trough. Miles is putting a little more water on it before he agitates the fibers with the CRB. Here's Carlo rinsing the rug. This is his second most favorite part. What's your favorite part, Carlo? The squeegee? Yeah. 
Who gonna squeeze it, Carlo? Yep. Okay. And when you get done, you gotta take a bow. Let's say, thank you very much. <laughs> Is this your favorite part, Carlo? Yeah. All right. Two hours later. Good job. Good job, son. All right, now we're on to our final step of the cleaning process. We are further rinsing this rug. The water is being pulled through the rug and into our extraction tube. So this allows us to get a good flush on this rug, rinsing out all the the dirty water and the urine, all the contaminants in this rug. I like how when you wet it, you can see it comes dry. Right. You can see that water just being pulled through the rug and out through the truck. Let me get He is focused. All right, clean team, it is the next day and this rug is completely dry. Now we're applying our solvent based protection. Once I'm done with this, we'll let this air dry. And this rug will be ready for delivery. I'm going to be delivering this rug Saturday. We have two jobs on the books, and then we're going to be delivering this rug right here, this rug, and this one behind the, um, the one up front. So we're going to have like a rug delivery day. But everything turned out well.
all right clean team that's the end of today's video thank you guys for watching this long if you're new to the channel don't forget to subscribe hit that notification bell smash that like button and leave us a comment down below and let us know what you thought if you're interested in some of the tools that we use in today's video check out our description we have the link to most of those there we're going to get the dirty water dump going for you and that will be the end so thanks for watching once again and i'll see you guys in the next one Like when they've been building ships for a long time, and then they put the ship in the water and it make that loud douche. Oh yeah. They might like that. It ain't gonna be that loud, but. Oh! Are you serious? Oh my goodness. Dude, I didn't think of that. It almost got in my mouth. I think it did. I think you liked it. <laughs> oh man, we got a mess. He came and is having fun in the pee water right now. Yeah. But. Alright, come on, you gotta pull it off. Oh, I guess where I got pee on it. A little bit. Where? Oh, hey, corn. That's what it is. You know what I'm saying? What we just did? We just pulled out the car and it's playing on them. Not really. So what do we just do? Oh, hopefully he'll fall. Can y'all hear me? He falls. He falls every day. Most of the cam. Most of the time, the camera's not on. But if we could get a fall on camera today, that would be golden. I'm just explaining what you're doing, man. Miles is putting a lot of water on this rug right now. See there, y'all? You can't hang with the big boys, Carlo. Can you, Carlo? Can you hang with the big boys? Look at this, Carlo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you've been hanging with the big boys all day. CRB. I got you. I'm, I'm a professional cameraman. All right, go ahead. I'm gonna cut your head out of it. Well, you waiting on me to fall or something? Waiting on you to fall? Is that what you're trying to do? No. <laughs> now, would I do that? <laughs> Who say anything about you falling? You know, I fall every day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> At least you know. <laughs> Call you Butterfeet. Yeah. I almost lost it. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> it was Coyote's already out. Who gonna, who gonna run a squeegee across it? Don't listen to Cayman. Alright, that's good. Just put like a whole bunch of water in one spot. You said we could get water and put what? You gonna expose me? <laughs> <laughs> he said you gonna expose me. <laughs> hey! <laughs> hey, we're having a good time, right? Tons of fun. I need to call <laughs> home so I don't get in trouble. <laughs> if you in, if you're interested in any, oh my, I can't even talk. If you're here, I'm here. If any, ooh, let that dog go. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> you got stuff all over you. All right, focus real quick. You focus. Sometime today. There we go. It's about time, G7X. Thank you for focusing. You got a black eye. All right, clean team.